What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the Mid-Level Media Channel, your hub for everything physical media and entertainment. And guys, I'm going to be doing a little thrifting uh, hunting video here today. I want to do more of these in 2023. I want to get back to my... I used to do this stuff all the time. I want to get back to my roots, do some more thrifting trips, go back to do some more half price book strips, Goodwill, pawn shops. I want to hit the hit the, hit the the location, hit the thrifting locations and see if I can find some stuff for a deal. I spent so much money on all these new releases, I could use a deal from time to time. So I'm going to hit up some uh, thrifting locations. Right now, I am at a game exchange, which I have not been to in quite some time. I think it's probably been almost a year since I've been here. And they don't usually have like the best deals in the world, but sometimes I'll find some pretty good prices here. Some Blu-rays for like $3.99 or something like that. And sometimes I'll have like a a buy two, get one free kind of deal. So I'll save some money uh, doing that. But we're going to go in this game exchange. Maybe I'll find some stuff. Maybe I won't. And I might go to a pawn shop, another like Peddler's Mall thrifting shop um, or Goodwill or something like that. We're going to hit up some places in this video. So stick around and enjoy the ride. But we are at game exchange. Let's go inside and see if they got any good stuff for us. All right, here we go. The game exchange. Maybe I'll find some games in here today or something else. I don't know.
so that's the game exchange and if you're unfamiliar with the game exchange they basically sell a lot of like retro video game stuff like past console video games and they also do like pop toys they do new video games as well but they also have a big like blu-ray and dvd and 4k uh, section as well they're actually running a deal it was like buy four dvds get six free or something like that but i was thinking about it and i was like well when all of your dvds are five dollars which is what i was looking at they were all five bucks is that really a deal because you buy four for five bucks so you got you spend twenty dollars to get uh, 10 dvds i mean i guess that's a deal depending on what you get uh that could be considered a deal um, but I did end up getting uh, three Blu-rays because there was a buy to get one free on the Blu-rays. And like I said, they don't have the best prices in there. I feel like I get better prices at a half price book. But I don't know, half price feels like they've been raising their uh, prices recently as well. But I got three movies that I'm actually excited uh, to have in the collection. So that's always a good thing. Um, I went ahead and grabbed Bulletproof. Um, on Blu-ray and this was $5.99. So I got all three of these. All three of these were $5.99. Got them for 12 bucks because I got to buy two, get one free. Uh, so they were basically all four bucks a piece. So Bulletproof on Blu-ray with uh, Damon Waynes and Adam Sandler. So I have not seen this movie since I was a kid. So happy to have this one in the collection on Blu-ray for sure. Um, and then I grabbed Sunshine. I may already have this in the collection. I don't think I do. I really don't think that I do. Um, this is a Danny Boyle directed film, science fiction movie. Pretty sure it's written by Alex Garland, who also did Ex Machina and Annihilation, recently Men. Um, but I've never seen this movie, and I've heard the best things about it. So if you're a fan of Sunshine, let me know. Uh, but I thought this was worth picking up on Blu-ray for sure. Now, I might get a, a 4K announcement soon. Well, probably not. I'm looking at 20th Century Fox. Now, this is not going to get a 4K, so I'm safe to... Uh, Disney owns 20th Century Fox. It's not going to get a 4K. I'm safe to pick it up on Blu-ray. Uh, but Sunshine, it, it looks like a cool movie, so I'm happy to have this one um, in the collection. And again, that was $5.99, brought down to $4 bucks with a buy-two, get one. And then I got a classic from my childhood. I've always loved this movie. It's a teen comedy uh, from, I believe, 1999. And this is also uh, owned by Disney, I'm pretty sure. So I think we're safe on it getting a 4K. I don't think it's going to get a 4K. Uh, but 10 Things I Hate About You... Went ahead and picked this up on Blu-ray. I don't have this in the collection. And I do love this movie. I used to watch this all the time uh, when I was a kid. Like 13, 14 when this movie came out. I watched it all the time. Loved it. Uh, it's got a great cast. Of course, Julia Stiles, Heath Ledger, Joseph, Je Joseph, uh, Joseph Gordon-Levitt um, is in this movie. So always been a big fan of this movie. So I'm excited to have this one um, in the collection as well. So those are my three pickups from the game exchange. I'm going to go... Uh, hit up, I think, one more location. We're going to go to a Goodwill and then go ahead and end this trip. So let's see if we have any luck there. Let's go. All right, so I decided to make a little stop at a Dollar General that I noticed along the way to the Goodwill. Uh, and I've never been to this Dollar General. I just discovered it. And, yeah, I'm going to see if they got any, any Blu-rays. I have noticed some people finding 4Ks in Dollar General, so maybe I'll, maybe I'll get some 4K action today. Who knows?
All right, so they actually had some uh, some new stuff in there that I haven't seen before. No 4Ks, but I did find one Blu-ray that I thought was worth uh, adding to the collection. This is a movie from 1978 starring classic film star Gregory Peck, and it's called McCarthy. Uh, so I have not seen this movie before, but I thought it was worth adding uh, to the collection for sure. Now, it is possible that this will get a 4K release at some point. I could see them uh, doing this movie. Universal usually... Uh, does a lot of their classic catalog in 4K. They just recently did To Kill a Mockingbird. So I could see it coming out in 4K, but I, I don't know when we'll see it in 4K. Maybe this year. It is the uh, 45th anniversary. But I got it on Blu-ray anyway. It was only $4. I figured it was worth uh, picking up. So yeah, have you all seen this movie? Is this, is this one any good? Is this a good classic film to add to the collection? Let me know um, in the comments. And yeah, let's go ahead and head to, uh, to Goodwill, see if we can finish out strong with this thrifting video let's go all right so i have arrived at the goodwill and i have had some luck at this goodwill before but i've also came up very short and just found nothing so we'll see what they got today All right, guys, so I didn't find anything in there. I almost thought about picking up Page Master on DVD, but uh, yeah, I, was, I found a couple Blu-rays though, so that was pretty cool. I don't usually find Blu-rays in the Goodwill. Um, but yeah, I didn't grab anything. That's gonna be it for my thrifting, hunting video today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you, if you can, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. I'm gonna try to do more of these in the near future. Like the video and then comment down below uh, whatever comments you want to make about what I picked up today, I would appreciate it. Turn on the bell notifications, follow me on my social media accounts down below, and I'll see you guys later.